the simplest possible isolation choke, a bunch of toroids strung on a length of coax, inside a piece of plastic sewer pipe for physical protection. Thus, its insertion loss is very low, and there is no chance for mice winding, etc., during construction. MFJ is notorious for poor quality control, and I've read of a few of these needing repair by purchasers, but I've bought three so far and all are mechanically and electrically good. No loose screws, no loose gluten caps, and no sign of poor soldering to the connectors inside when I did electrical tests. Test number 1, very low DC resistance into end on center and shield and not shorted either. Test number 2, running over the entire HF band up to 30 MHz, testing them with an antenna analyzer and a 50 ohm resistive load, they show essentially no reactants, 1 to 1 SWR or very close. As you get into the low VHF, things start to fall apart a bit, usable up to maybe 6 meters as I recall. A Balan Designs isolator, built with a single wound toroid, did just about as well. Another brand, which I won't mention, with a single wound toroid of the same design, started misbehaving between 7 and 14 MHz. Click link in description for more reviews.